So I want to know which are your musical references nowadays, if you keep listening to the same music or you do listen to like no, new I, music? I always open to, uh, to uh, hearing good music. At the moment I'm working on the project of a fantastic Azerbaijanian singer called uh, Alim Kazimov. Uh, yeah, that's really high art. Uh, I'm sure Frank would love this work. Uh, another one is a Syrian, uh, Ibrahim Kefo. He is more a troubadour. Uh, he speaks uh, like 13 different languages. Tries to keep the heritage of, uh, you know, people like uh, uh, Armenians, Assyrians, Kurdish people, uh, Syriac people. Uh, so, as, as you said the other day, culture doesn't end in the States and in Europe, <laughs> looks like that. Yeah, no, I mean, the, the great ideas, of course, when countries like America and, and countries like Europe and, and will understand that they're just one of, the, one, of the, one of the countries in the world and not the superior country, mm -hmm. that would be ideal, of course. Zabat spoke about this, yes, too. That's a, a, which Zappa would agree upon, I'm sure, but this is from John Cage. Okay. American composer. Yeah, I know. I know. Um, because I know American composers, but I don't know the other ones you, you talked about. Uh, is it possible to be a huge artist and not try to change things a little bit? Like, uh, I mean, po it is possible, but... Ch changing things has always to do with uh, how many people you reach. And in that sense, I think uh, Frank Zappa, of course, uh, was certainly, but as I experienced it here in Buenos Aires, is still uh, a major artist, an important artist. And um, um, but 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 I generally think of that in a genetic way. It's not necessarily that an artist at a certain point has to have a lot of people uh, knowing about his work. Uh, but if the work uh, uh, will grow like in an evolution mm -hmm. and will um, um, impregnate the culture of the future, then that can be a very important one. Although in his time he might seem not to be so important. Look at Perez. I think Perez is his great time still has to come because he is, he is a visionary of 21st century music. And that was Frank Zappa's great hero. Yeah, and the way they both uh, took their message or whatever, and they stayed uh, attached to this, and they said, I'm going to do this. I'm not going to work in an office or whatever. I'm going to do what I really feel, whatever happens. Yeah, so like this is Joseph Campbell says, follow your bliss. <laughs> But, uh, in the, I mean, with Perez, it's so fantastic that we already in 1919, when there was the first attempt for United Nations called the Falcon Boot, uh, uh, came into existence. He wrote them a letter, I'm talking about 1919, that there should be a united, the, the, the nation, a united organization of artists of the world. Mm -hmm. That would be 